What's going on guys? It's Fatal Reaper Day back again with another video. Today I'm going to be talking about Warzone 2 and how you may see all these streamers and all these people get these easy lobbies it seems where they're dropping 20, 30 kills easily. I'm going to show you guys how to get bot lobbies. Now, some people look at this and kind of frown upon it. I'm, I assure you every single streamer you see out there is using this. I don't see a problem with it, and that's a VPN. Everyone knows that by now. All your professionals use it. Um, it, it helps and it doesn't help. It, it, sometimes you can get bot lobbies. Sometimes you're going to get sweats still in the lobbies. But a, a good portion of the time, you are going to get lobbies. Now, this does cost money. It is not free. So this next portion, I'm going to be showing you guys where you can get your VPN, where I recommend getting it, where I got it, um, and how much it was to get these easier lobbies. That being said, here we are at, um, it, uh, you'll go to this website right here, sbmmoff.com. Now, this is the VPN that I've gone with. You can go with other VPNs of your choices or look up other ones, but this is what you're going to, the general basis of what you're going to be able to do to get your easier bot lobbies. And you can check that in your network settings in Call of Duty Warzone 2 when you, uh, you know, click whatever you want to use for your uh, servers I use an open uh, open for the type and then I, I usually go for India for um, my server where you can choose what country um, like I said it, you can find different ones that for your liking better connection maybe you get better you know better lobbies with uh, different places and such like that now it is fifty dollars for a lifetime but that is a lifetime membership that gives you the VPN forever I bought it for fifty dollars. Um, it's been great. I've used it. I used it in Rebirth. I used it in uh, Fortune's Keep back when Warzone 1 was still a thing. Um, I do miss that so much. But Warzone 2 is a good... It, yeah, I like the island map, um, and I do like Vondel, so... Uh, it, it's it's a good placebo, I guess, <laughs> over the Rebirth and what whatnot. But like I said, guys, this is how you basically can get your easier bot lobbies. And let's be honest, everyone uses them. This is not like a mystery or anything like this, like that. All these streamers use this. They probably use higher paid VPNs and stuff like that. I know for a fact they do. But uh, I'm just being open and honest that I do, in fact, use one. Uh, I mean, it, does, it, do, it doesn't exactly make it just have easy lobbies. A lot of people think, oh, you're going to get bot lobbies and you're going to win every single game. Nah. There are some lobbies you'll get where there's just total sweat still in the game. I fought people that are hacking in the game, level 1,000 people in the game just, you know, lasering me, it doesn't necessarily mean you're going to get bot lobbies, it just gives you a better portion, uh, or better, better chance, basically, to get lobbies that are slightly easier, so you don't have to sit there and sweat the entire time, and you can kind of just kind of casually play and drop high kill games, I have dropped 20 plus game kills, or 20 games, or 20 bombs, uh, in games, I've dropped almost 30 kills in a few, as my, uh, sadly I wasn't recording those, but, um, some I did where I was dropping 20, 20, 20 plus games. But uh, basically, it will give you easier lobbies and make the people you can definitely see drastically easier to fight and maneuver around. Uh, that's in quads, solos, and whatever you're playing. Um, that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, um, leave me some comments down below. Be sure to get back to you. Um, but that is basically how you get easier bot lobbies in Warzone. Like I said, you can check that in your network settings in Warzone if it did uh, put you to the correct country that you've chosen in your VPN once you get it. Like I said, it is $50, but that it comes with a lifetime, and that gives you the VPN forever. And you can use that. You could have used that on Warzone 1, which is what I, what I did, and now I use it on Warzone 2, and I'm assuming we'll be able to use it on Warzone 3. So I highly recommend it. VPNs are definitely fun to use. Um, it definitely makes lobbies a lot easier. Uh, again, like and subscribe, guys. See you guys in the next video.